Welcome back to your live continuing coverage of CE Week 2015. You're the Terrifics. You are terrific. I'm Michael Artsis. Thank you so much for watching. We're here in New York City, my home away from home. City so nice, they named it twice. The place I love, the city that never sleeps, like me. Uh, I, I, I grew up here. Like, this was my stomping ground. It's so cool to do a show here. Like, I'm blocks away from where I grew up. 13th between 3rd and 4th. We're on 18th between 7th and 6th. How cool is that? Awesome. It's like I'm home doing a show. So am I. This is my hometown. <laughs> you grew up here? I grew up in New York, in Brooklyn. In Brooklyn. In Canarsie. Yeah. And now I live out in Los Angeles, but I always miss it and love coming you back You got here. it, right? There's something, like I live in New Jersey, I call myself a transplanted New Yorker. So do I. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you're really a transplanted New Yorker. I'm across a bridge. I come over here every day. Yeah, I don't get here every day, but would love to if I could. Yeah, and, and, and you miss it, right? There's something about this city. They say you can take the New Yorker out of New York, but you can't take the New York out of the New Yorker. If I told you how many times that I've been in California, they say, where are you from? What part of the East Coast? And they can pin me out because you're absolutely right. Yeah. You can take the boy out of New York, but you cannot take hey, the New York out of Forget the about it. My wife would get on a plane or something. My wife, you know, somebody says, where are you from? I go, uh, New York. My wife slaps me. She's like, we're from New Jersey. I'm like, ah. No, you're from New York. New York. <laughs> Um, yeah, I love anyway. this place. It's amazing. We're at the Metropolitan Pavilion. This is CE Week 2015. All sorts of amazing products. You've got Sleep Pace. Uh, this is cool because, as I said, it's a city so nice that they named it twice, and it's a city that never sleeps. Well, there are a lot of people who don't sleep, who have trouble sleeping. Um, I know the viewers can probably believe this. Uh, I don't. I sleep like a baby because I um, I run myself till the batteries need to be recharged, and then, ooh, you better get me on that charger, or I just fall asleep wherever I am. You know, according to the National Institutes of Health, 50 to 70 million people have problems sleeping. My wife, Jill, and this is no joke, I, I love my wife, she's an amazing woman. We have uh, no clocks in the bedroom, the only clocks are our phones turned upside down at night. Uh, she's been to a sleep uh, doctor, a sleep clinic, uh, everything, and it really helped her. But she suffers from insomniac. It's, it's very serious, and there are a lot of people like her. Well, there's some things that can help in that specific area as well. And usually they said, and what we have is the red light on here. Yeah. Red light helps you produce melatonin. Melatonin is what helps us sleep. And also, when you have those nightly non-available to sleep, it's usually because your mind is racing, and we also always have those tossing and turning nights. Well, this light sound that comes out of this tower, which is called the Knox Tower, allows you to eliminate or to lower those by not focusing on the thoughts you have. So it's a white noise? Excuse it's me? a white noise? No, no, it's, it's a, uh, a, I'm sorry, yes, it is a white noise. Okay. Like. Um, waterfalls or streams sure. or something like that. So you get a white noise out of here and then you've got the light that soothes you. Right. Okay, and, and then we, it gets, it, I can tell already there's more to it because yeah. you've got uh, some kind of strap and, um, and, and also you've got uh, an app on your phone. That's well, popular. first thing you have to do obviously. This is a great start by the way, right. very good start. I like that. That starts you up so you can fall asleep. First thing the sleep doctor said to my wife, I'm giving this out for free, the doctor charged a lot of money, cover all your clocks, no television in the bedroom, no mm -hmm. reading. No exercising before bed within three hours. But the biggest thing is cover the clocks. Right. No clocks. And that's the idea that this will, as soon as you're starting to fall asleep, this band will actually recognize it with the sensor and turn that off. So do you wear that band? No. This fits actually Thank underneath God you don't the wear that sheet. Band. <laughs> well, we found that non-wearables, actually your point is well taken, because people don't like to wear things at night. I know I take off my watch, any jewelry I have, is always off at night when I sleep. I take off my world championship wrestling belt when Do I go you? to sleep, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's a good thing. <laughs> anyway, this fits underneath, and in order to hold it in place, we have a patented magnetic lock. And in this box is the smart brain. So I put that around the mattress, under no, the sheet. you put sheets. it underneath the sheet. Underneath the sheet, yeah, right. around the mattress. Well, not all the way because it's only halfway. Okay, <laughs> so underneath okay. the sheet. Right, and then this connects on the side of the sheet to hold it in place. Okay. Once you do that, this starts recognizing all your traits. Now do I feel that through the sheet? Feel it, you tell me. Not that, this. Oh, this, so this is on the you side of the bed. It. I use it all the no, time and I don't feel, feel it. Yeah, it's really thin. Thinner than the bed pad I use. That's correct. And the bed pan. The bed pan, huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, you sure you don't like have I one said, here with all the interviews when I'm, when, I'm <laughs> when I'm really down, I'm down, you know? <laughs> that, that is down. All right, but so we've got the this around the, the mattress, underneath right. the sheet. You've got this next to the nightstand, around right. the nightstand. You turn on your app, yep. and the first thing that it will tell you is it will monitor the room, and that has a sensor in it to do that. The things it monitors are things like temperature, yeah. humidity, light, and noise in the room. After a couple of days, you'll notice what they are, and you'll know what to lower it. 
you said earlier, your wife has a hard time sleeping. Mm -hmm. And that's what they told them is, shut down all the clocks and everything else, all the distractions that you have. And that's what basically this is noticing. I don't know if you can see this. Yep, we can get a shot of it. Just hold it up for everybody. You have Android and iOS? Yes. Okay, excellent, very cool. There you go. And, and, and that's, uh, yeah. that's what it actually monitors. That's but great. The next thing that's even better. You know, they're not going to need doctors in the uh, new century. Uh, you always need doctors. You still need that personal touch. I agree, I'm just kidding. Then it gives you a report, and the report will tell you, give you a sleep score, and you notice on the bottom here, it also has the percentage of deep sleep and things that go on in you, because deep sleep is more important. You can yeah. sleep eight hours and still be tired. You can sleep five hours and not be tired. It depends on how much deep sleep you really have. Yeah. And that's what causes. And then how the do you get into deep sleep? Do you know? Do you know the trick? Well, actually, as you start to sleep, yeah. when you don't have as much tossing and turning, when you've had a, a proper day and you're really tired, you'll go into a deeper and deeper sleep. Those are clinical answers that actually we're trying to find out as well through some studies that we're So, I'm, I kid you not, I got a two-year-old son, his name's Jack. My wife has trouble sometimes getting him to sleep. When he's with me alone, I don't have trouble. The reason why is because when it's bedtime or getting close to bedtime and he's got all this energy, I don't tell him it's bath time and let's relax you. Mm -hmm. uh, I take him out in the hallway, we live in an apartment, and I, uh, I have him run suicides. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, yeah. We call them Herbies as hockey players, and we, I run with them and we run in the hallway back and forth and back and forth until he's ready to pass out. You know, not really right. pass out. I don't really run him into the ground, but he gets tired. He runs all that energy off. Then we put him in the bath, bath time, then we get into the crib and then, I mean, literally, when, when I put him to sleep, it's five minutes, boom, like that. But you said something interesting before. You I, said I, your I, wife, even if she, they tell her not to exercise, actually, if you exercise within an hour before you sleep, that might actually be You know, bad. they say it's bad. They say it's bad, but I'll tell you. I don't agree with that man, either. Man, you wear me down, I got nothing left. I, you don't even have to find me a bed. Mm -hmm. Last night, I, we did this all day. I mean, I think it was the first time I've fallen asleep before 10 o'clock in, in probably 10 years. Really? I literally stumbled in the house. I went for a walk with uh, Jack and Jill. Those are my, my wife and kid. How about mm -hmm. that? Huh? And That's then I, interesting. <laughs> thank you. And, uh, and, you have and, a hill and, behind your house? And Nikki and the dog. Huh? I said, do you have a hill behind uh, your yes, house? Yes, we have a hill. Yeah. No, we don't. We anyway. actually do. We live on the, uh, on, in, in, in Fort Lee on the uh, edge. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. And um, and then I, I just like she was putting him to sleep, and I was like, oh, I'm gonna lay down for a few minutes. Let right. me just put my alarm on my phone just in case. And I woke up this morning. And that's what it is. Yeah. You, and that, look, well, that's a good I'm thing energized. about this too. You don't have to have your phone in the room. Once you turn on the app, yeah. unlike some competition, you don't have to have this on. You turn, you can put your phone in another room. You know why this is good? Because it's knowledge, and knowledge is the the key to doing all this. It's very important. So this gives me the report. Right. This is the report that you yeah. get. Uh, from the app at the end of the uh, day when you turn off the, you got it? Can you? This is going to help people sleep. I really, yeah. I'm, I'm serious. This is going to help and people sleep. It's so important. Well, here's the thing. Yeah. That not only does it tell you what the actions are, such as your heart rate, your breath rate. All from that? All from that. That sends, it actually stores it in here in the brain and then it sends it right to your phone. I'm very and then impressed. At the morning when you look at it, you say, well, look, I, this seems to be a little out of whack. Yeah. So whatever number is out of whack, if you press it, It'll give you a helpful tip, a clinically proven tip, to help you improve your sleep for the next night. This is very smart. And then those are the things that how, you can think How of. much is this? The product itself, this product is 149. Yeah. The light product or the Knox is 129 as a bundle, which yeah. we're going to do when it comes out in October. Wait, wait, hold on a sec. Did you just say this is 149 and this is how much? 129. With, as a bundle? Now as a bundle, no, it's 279. Okay, I was going to say, if a math isn't working here. This okay. is not in yet. Okay. This is not available till October. Okay. This is available right now on Amazon and some of the others, because we just started selling it right. about two months ago. Very nice. Yep. So this is uh, very exciting, and where do people buy it? On sleeppace.com? Amazon. Amazon. Com. Or, well, we have a, a website, which yeah. is www.sleepaceusa.com. They can buy it there. I'm telling you, a lot of our viewers, you said the mind races. Th this is what they suffer from. A lot of our viewers do have sleep problems, and I, as sleeping is very important. I think this is going to help a lot of people. I, I would like to try it for my wife. I'm serious. She's, she still has we'll, sleeping problems. We'll make sure we help you out with that. Oh, that would be great. We're, uh, we'll, we're, and we'll talk about it on air and tell you how she's doing. We can even uh, show her reports. That uh, actually be even better. If she's okay with that. I don't we know. did have some she'll, she'll be okay with it. We had some issues and I actually pulled the product for three months until we improved the accuracy. Really? And so now it's working exceptionally well. Excellent. We're currently doing a study at Stanford University yeah. uh, where they're 
comparing this to the PSG, which are professional grade monitors to see how well we, our accuracy is. I would love to hear about that. Yeah. And I'll tell you, I, this September. is going to help a lot of people because sleeping is so important. And, and you, I don't know if you've seen the studies, S driving tired is worse than driving and drinking. Absolutely. Not they that say, you should drive and drink. Well, here's the thing. Uh, according to it, there were over 10,000 or, or, and more accidents because yes. of non-sleep, and there I, are much I, more that go unreported. I can tell you firsthand, I fell asleep at the wheel once in my life, yeah. once. It's terrible, it's terrifying, it's terrible. Luckily, realize. nothing happened, it will never happen again, but you got to, you, anything you do, you can't be sleepy. You got to make sure you get the proper night's sleep. And again, you said, it doesn't mean that it's 10 hours of sleep, it means that you sleep deeply during right. that time. And that's what she learned, they actually shrunk her bedtime. They, they, they didn't tell her they were doing this, so they wouldn't let her go to bed till three in the morning. So she had to sit up every night. And she'd be like, oh my God, this is so hard now, I'm so tired. Like, it's not hard when nobody tells you you can't go to, when, if they don't tell you you can't fall asleep till three, you could fall asleep. Uh, or you could stay up. But when they tell you you have to stay up till three, she's like, oh my God. That's and we'd stay up every night, but they were wearing her down. And then they'd shorten, they made her get up at a certain time. They were compressing her sleep to give her the deep sleep and then, you know, it, I, it, this is this is beautiful. This is right. going to help a lot of people, especially people who don't go to the doctor, can't go to the doctor, don't know about it, don't want to go to the doctor, don't have insurance. This is great. All right, so sleeppace.com and Amazon. But I want to just run this. Yeah. Forty percent of the sleep problems go unrecognized and unnoticed because people don't realize that they're tired. Right. They just yawn or whatever happens, and then they have the accidents. This is what we're going to do. Like uh, we're going to get it for Jill, and we're going to test it out. We're going to talk about it on air. Sleeppace.com, Amazon. Don't wait to get it. It's, it's going to be awesome. It's actually sleeppaceusa.com. 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 Right. I'm serious. This is really, really important. I'm Appreciate not kidding. That. We're going to get her on it. And uh, by the way, we test me too. And you know what? It's going to show lights out, baby. That's great. I'm going to be I like, whatever it. the best score is, I bet you I get the best scores. I'm well, not, that's not boasting. That's not, I'm not, I'm telling you, I'm like, you may be surprised. You may be surprised you could drive a fire truck through my bedroom <laughs> and I'll still sleep. I'm, well, I hope I'm that's the kidding. case because you're wide awake now. I used, to, I used to have Rage Against the Machine in my CD mm -hmm. alarm clock, cranked all the way up. My neighbors must have hated me. And I would sleep a half an hour into the music. That's not good because yeah. oh, it's the way not. to really wake up is something like this where we have, where it becomes a sunrise at the uh, end of your like sleep that. cycle and it takes you out of deep sleep, puts you into light sleep. Does it know when you're at? Yes, it, the, so it, it recognizes it through the sensors. So it, it when recognizes you when you're in light sleep, it starts to wake you up as opposed to when you're in deep sleep, which is actually correct. good too. Yeah. So I you like don't that. wake up groggy with that groggy yeah. effect. It actually, you can set it to work 30 minutes or 20 minutes from when you actually want to wake up. So it slowly brings you out of that deep sleep. I love it, I so love it. All right, sleeppaceusa.com, sleeppaceusa.com. You. You're awesome, I love it. This is CE Week, your live continuing coverage on Be Terrific. In New York City, I'm Michael Larson. We'll be back right after this, don't go